It is my firm belief that you do not need a built-in HD camera on your garage door opener motor, but LiftMaster insists that you do. Let's party. So this is the LiftMaster 84504R. This is their latest introduction to the garage door motor space that offers pretty much everything that you can get out of the LiftMaster 87504 with the exception of having a 350 degree LED light array. Now that's not to say that this motor does not have LEDs built in. It does have two LEDs right here that will illuminate up to 1000 lumens each, which clearly means that you're gonna get nice lighting in your garage with these 2000 lumens and it is my professional opinion that better lighting beats out an HD camera. Now talking about that camera, it's the same one that you're gonna find on the Chamberlain and LiftMaster garage door opener motors. With one exception, unlike the 87504, you are not able to maneuver or position this specific camera. It stays fixed at one spot. Now that's not a big miss, but I do believe that some customers might gripe that they're not gonna be able to position the HD camera slightly to the left or to the right. Nevertheless, it's still the same type of camera that's gonna give you that 140 degree field of view that pretty much covers the entire width of your garage door. Now this garage door opener motor will come with all the necessary peripherals and parts to install properly. You get the multifunction wall button, you get a battery backup, you also get the nice nubby safety sensors that I really like and appreciate because you can fit these in smaller spaces. And of course, a single remote transmitter that happens to have three buttons. So I feel that this garage door opener motor is positioned perfectly for those high-end customers that perhaps already have an 87504 on their two car garage door and they're looking to supplement their single car garage door with a similar garage door opener motor. Now I do feel that this can be put on any type of garage door. This happens to be a belt drive garage door opener motor. It is equivalent to the three quarter horsepower, more the high end torque that's necessary to lift heavier doors. Definitely your non-insulated doors, of course your steel back insulated doors, but I would be weary, that is I would be cautious about installing it on perhaps a custom wood door, a very thick heavy door. Usually those doors require a very strong motor, so I'm not 100% sure if this will hang, but it's gonna do great on standard residential garage doors and of course on single car garage doors if you are looking to supplement your complete garage door system. Now I have installed this garage door opener motor on a few of my customers doors and honestly I think it's a good motor. I, I don't think it's a bad motor but the fact that again LiftMaster is including a camera in the garage door opener motors pretty much tells me, means to me, that they are all in. Yes they're married to this idea and that's perfectly fine because I do feel that a lot of people will care about having some sort of camera or some sort of type of surveillance to their garage and being that it's already provided on the garage door opener motor might be a benefit for some. But again, I don't think you need it. And the fact that LiftMaster insists that their garage door opener motors, at least on the higher end products, have them just tells me again that they just want to stick with this business plan and these type of models. Now LiftMaster does offer a belt drive garage door opener motor without an HD camera. I just can't get it in my local area. Nevertheless, Keeping in mind that that experience, that is the experience of this motor, the 84504R, and that other motor, I can't remember the model right now, they're gonna be virtually the same because the only thing different about them is that HD camera. It's gonna offer a quiet DC motor, it's gonna offer Wi-Fi capabilities with the MyQ platform, and of course it has this spacey, stormtrooper, minimalistic or utilitarian design that some might like, and others will probably hate. Personally, I like this design a lot more than the 87504. I would have preferred that LiftMaster provided LEDs all around here and keeping this small boxy design, keeping it compact, quiet, to where it doesn't have a lot of buzz or ring because you do get that from the actual housing. This is the way to go. I think the 87504 would have looked a lot better if it would have offered pretty much LEDs all around, but hey, 
they didn't ask me, it is what it is. I prefer this motor just because of the looks, but then again, it does have some drawbacks in the sense that you're not able to move that camera. And again, that won't be a big miss because at least you do have a camera and it will be positioned towards the garage. I rarely see a lot of my customers reposition the camera to an angle or at an angle where they kind of see their garage. Nevertheless, there are some applications where I do believe that would be necessary or perhaps practical but in this case, you're just not gonna get that. Now the installation process to this garage door opener motor is gonna be like all the other LiftMaster motors. It comes with a one piece belt rail assembly. If you have all of the necessary tools and all of the necessary know-how, installing this motor should be a breeze. Now that being said, this is just simply an unboxing and impressions video. It's not a full review because I still want to play with this garage door opener motor. I still want to understand the ins and outs of it. I wanna be able to have a clear defined idea why LiftMaster introduced this garage door opener motor in my area or even at all. Why would they not want to just simply provide a belt drive garage door opener motor without an HD camera so that way they could differentiate that is their high end motor to the mid range motor and then offer like a low end motor. It just really baffles me. At any rate, it's a really good motor to start off with. But again, I still need some more time and I wanna be able to play with it so that way I can provide you party people a good review. Now that being said, this video is not sponsored by LiftMaster, no money exchanged hands. In fact, I purchased this garage door opener motor with my own money, but this video does have a sponsor and that is our merch store. So please, if you have the opportunity to go check out our merch store, we have a number of baseball caps that offer some great spring sizes. And quite frankly, if you're a big fan of garage door motors, garage doors, or garage door technology, well, these caps are great for those true fans. Of course, if you're interested in a flagship experience out of your garage door opener motor, then let's keep this party going. Check out one of these videos right here. As always, I wanna thank y'all for partying with me. Y'all stay safe.